Obviously, you guys can't see, but I'm shaking my booty. Shaking my booty. Because I can shake my booty now because she's physically behind me, so it looks like I can shake my booty in her face. Shake my booty in her face. Uh, I forgot where I'm going. This way. Oh, God, she's running. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Great Level of Gaming. I am the Great Leveler, and today we're playing on the PSVR 2. I we're playing some Resident Evil Village once more. Oh, now, last episode, if you remember, if you haven't checked it out, of course, check it out now. What are you waiting for? Link is in the description. But in that episode, we played through the tutorial, which was actually a lot of fun because we got to learn how the gun mechanics work in the VR. We played through the opening ambush, and we got all the way up to House Democratic. And as we mentioned in that video, each episode is going to be more of a speed run, highlight run, if you want to watch the full uninterrupted kind of playthrough that I suggest you check out my cinematic let's play uh, link to that is also in the description there you can see the full story with all the cutscenes intact this is more for highlights to see how it compares on the VR uh, so we're going to be focusing this episode just on House of Damithresk hopefully it shouldn't take me too long to get through this section because I played it obviously before I know where the puzzles are and I played it again recently for something unconnected to this so I'm a little bit more up to date, but I've never played it in VR and I'm so freaking excited for this. Uh, it's just it's just something I'm really, really looking forward to. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. There's not really much more to say. Uh, this was in the original playthrough. House Diamond Thress was a little bit of a letdown compared to how the game trailers had built it up because it was over like that. Uh, but this section and House Danny DeVito, yes, I know it's not called that House Danny DeVito. It's, Beneviento or something like that, but you know, I'm a funny guy, so it's Danny DeVito because, haha, hilarious as I am. Uh, but those two were for me the highlights of the game, and then after that, kind of declined a little bit in quality. But that was before playing the VR, and I think some of the uh, things that I didn't enjoy will be a lot more fun, you know, when it's all around me. So, really, really excited. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Again, highlights if you want for a full playthrough, check out the, the full Let's Play. But with that being said, let's crack on. So here we are, guys, back in house Dometresk. I got my gun, I got my knife, and we're ready to rock and roll. Now, I, I've been watching a couple of VR videos about how to improve. Could Rose be here? No, she, well, technically, yes, she is, but no, she's not. Uh, yeah, I've been reading like tutorials on how to improve video quality. I mentioned in one of my videos, but I think I actually cut that out, that the game's only um, playing in 10, uh, 1080p. That's actually incorrect. It's playing in, oops, it's playing in 4K, but it only records at 1080p. So you're actually not seeing the full effect. However, I think I might be able to change that, but I'll have to find out. I meant to tinker before I started, but I was so excited to get the game that I just didn't, but it still looks freaking awesome. So, you know, no great loss there. Um, there was a couple of other things. Uh, I'm trying recording with my front facing, sorry, the rear facing camera, you know, the proper camera on my phone. The reason I don't tend to use that very often is because, uh, I don't know if I remember right, there's a diamond. In fact, can I get it with a knife? <laughs> yes, I can. Uh, yeah, so I usually use my front-facing camera because I can see the screen, see if there's any problems with the recording. I'm going to risk not using that uh, because I think it's better quality, even though it's recording at the same resolution and frame rate. Uh, I think it's actually better quality uh, with the front-back-facing camera because obviously it's, you know, it's, a, it's how it's supposed to be. Uh, other news as well. Uh, what was I thinking? I just love picking up the gun. I don't know why it's such a simplistic thing, but just grabbing the gun is just awesome. What? I'm doing that. It's just so much fun. Uh, yeah, so, one of the other things as well. Um, just smashing the shit, sorry. Uh, what, what was the other thing? Oh, yes, so, as I'm watching my footage back, I, it was bothering me, because obviously you get the circle when I start moving it goes dark that's to reduce Ooh. that's to reduce motion sickness but I notice it seems to just focus on this eye so that's in front of my left eye I don't know if you can even see that hand but I clicked something there didn't mean to click 
Um, I don't know why it's called track me. Uh, yeah, so basically it's following this eye, not this eye. So it's that's why the screen seems to go darker because you're just getting the, the footage from one eye. I didn't notice that on Horizon. So I'm hoping that that is just a, a Resident Evil thing. It doesn't matter, it's still good, but I might in the next episode, if it's really annoying, I might try and remove the Vigilet or Viginet, whatever it's called, so that I can, you see more on the screen. Anyway, let's crack on, we've talked enough. Ready? And I can't wait to see what it's like in VR. <gasps> oh God. Oh, I guess I'm, oh yes. This looks gorgeous. <gasps> oh god, I never felt I'm glad I got the set seat behind me. Man blood. Oh god, I can tell you what guys, they look good in 3D. <laughs> this looks weird though because I'm going through my body. Let's see if I can recenter. No. Have I lost my knife? Mother, I, lost my... I bring you fresh prey. You are so kind to me, daughters. <laughs> oh. So I can see the hooks already. Let's take a look I at love the... Hi, it's me again. Well, I lived. You In the flesh. My little brothers in games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Yes, yep. yes. If she was actually your mother, I bet childbirth was so easy for her because her hips are like wide. Oh. oh god, you look. Hmm. Starting to go a little stale. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, don't. To be fair, girls, you all captured me. So let's be fair. You can all have a piece. There will be enough for everyone. <laughs> you calling me fat? I like how he's just peacefully just stood here, not resisting or anything. <laughs> oh, now I've got a body though. This is what gets me. Oh, God, this is. So good. Bye. Oh, I can't wave in actual game. I can't tell you three apart, just so you know. So don't be offended when I call you the wrong name later. Later? No, I said it like that. Can I? Okay. So I can't pick up a candle, but I can act like a badass and pretend to set my hand on fire. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. So here we're in Castle. And now the fun begins. <gasps> oh wow. I remember the first time I played this uh the demo Maiden. Because I don't forget I played Resident Evil 4 on the PlayStation 4. Then I got a PlayStation 5 and I played this on the PlayStation 5, the Maiden demo, and that's the first time I saw the chandelier and they were... Oh, wrong button. Awesome. <laughs> hey. Oh, I had something break. I really don't mind. <laughs> so I'm gonna break them. It's all good in the hood. Yeah. Ooh, see what I mean? I'm not looking at what I'm supposed to be looking at because the game doesn't move me to that position. Oh, I really want to waste some hour on you. But that's no good. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, just, I just... Oh. 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 I remember what I said the last time she told me that, and I still stand by that statement. Oh, God, you're so cool. You are... Oh shit, you could come in here. I didn't think she'd follow me in there. Whew. Okay, whew. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Is this Lady Damatresque? I love that name. It took ages to learn how to pronounce it, but now that I think I've got it nailed, 
just fun to say. Hello, Lily. Dometress. And that fat ass. Oh, she's... Oh! She trained the little birdies. That's what she's been drinking, the little birdies. That's awful. Really sexy of her. <laughs> okay, let's crack on. Oh, there is a hand still in here. High five. So this should be, this puzzle bothered me a lot in the main <coughs> game. So hopefully it should be easier because I could ju should just be able to push it. <coughs> yeah. So it's not easy. It would be better if I could just grab it since I had the ability to, <coughs> to grab. <coughs> Yes. I'm not taking in the detail though, I'm just so excited to get through it that I'm actually forgetting to comment on how gorgeous everything looks and how sharp and rusty they look. Oh, and now I've purposely been waiting for this moment because I want to do that and move like this. Like a badass. Now I heard someone actually say you should do it like that for the recoil, which I get, but this just feels more natural. Really badass. Anyway, I don't need the gun yet. I know you're around here somewhere. But yeah, the, the thumbsticks add a whole new damage to the game. And seeing that, coming out of the shadows, seeing the shadows move with my flashlight, this is unprecedented gameplay. Fuck you, by the way. <laughs> Oh shit, uh, um, panicking, <laughs> I have to reload. Uh, you know what, I don't need to leave him. Get out of my way. I'll take that. I don't actually need to fight any of these guys, that was just a bit of fun. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Again, that reload mechanic. Uh, it, it's so fun just to kind of like bang, 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 fire, but then the reload is a lot more trickier. You know, you always complain, I oh, reload fast in these games. Well, now the reload's down to me, so when it goes wrong, it's because of me. Oh, shut the hell up, please. Uh, see, this is what I mean. My cuts need to turn around now, and it feels a bit jar. Oh, actually, that was actually all right. I don't remember how to block. I'll slice your throat and stuff it with worms. Shit, I thought I had a six ammo. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, oh. Waste of ammo. Didn't do anything, but it felt like I did. Plus, we all know as the game. Oh, wow, that was gorgeous in 3D. We know as the game goes on, we have to blow that The only issue I've been having with this game is because I'm having to hold this. So when I grab the gun, I have to keep that. Oh, in fact, let's reload. I'm having to keep that down. And it, I end up realizing I'm squeezing the pad. Now, I get it because you can do stuff like that and you can quickly drop. And that's why it's important to hold it down, but it does require me to squeeze the pad and I don't like that because I feel like I'm going to break something. But fingers crossed that won't happen. Now does this bitch appear now? I feel like this bitch appears now. I'm trying to think of something witty, but I can't think of anything. So, bye, see? Yeah, that'd be a lot more intimidating if this room didn't scare you. That was a cool exit though, I will give you that. 
But how do I check my health anyway? That is not good. But I just remembered this is how I. I forgot I had a shotgun. I thought I hadn't picked that up yet. Oh. I'm glad that I don't waste ammo because that's so much fun to do. I thought I had some. I'm sure I picked up some health. And yet, logic dictates otherwise. Hmm. I just did it with my finger, I didn't even need my knife. I didn't even grab a fit, I just boink! And it, uh, it opened. There we go, like freaking Bruce Lee. Why is that not doing more damage? So the lack of health I have, I probably, this is probably not the best tactic, but it's the most fun tactic. He's like, how many more knives could you possibly have? And the answer is infinite. Come on guys, that look cool, right? Yeah, it did. Yeah, I got it all the way down. I love the hip fire. I feel like a badass. I look like a badass as well. I don't even lie. Pretend I don't. Fuck you. I know you're coming. This is the most badass game I've ever. I can't wait. I, I want to play that. Um, what's it called? Uh, Walking Dead game. I've heard that's really good. Oh shit. Yes, baby. Shit, only five bullets left though, that's not good. Again, squeezing this pad though, I really feel like it's gonna wear. It's gonna really gonna start noticing now. So one of the things I wanna increase, I don't know if I wanna increase this gun's quality. Um, because I know that I get better pistol later on. But um, <clears throat> but I want to increase the ammo on it. That's bullshit. Is that going to kill me? You know what? Let's not risk it, shall we? Ooh, last bullet. I'm fine. Can I grab a herb? No, I can't grab a herb. I am invisible. You, you, one of your superpowers is clearly not peripheral vision. God damn, she looks so good. The dress is awful, but she looks good. Okay, the mirror effect looks a little weird. Mother like. That's weird in 3D because that's clearly a 2D image. Almost, I don't know how to describe that. It's a very strange. Oh, keep hitting the wrong button. I don't even know what I'm pressing. Because yeah, it looks very strange. And has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him, no. I mean, it's not a bad effect. When I'm in front of the mirror, I wouldn't. Yes, I'll have to have a look when I go through. Understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. Bitch is gonna let it down. 
Okay, I guess I'm going to check out reflection. That man pay for what he's done. She says that, and yet I don't. See, the thing is with that, I have to put the key in and I have to grab it a separate time to do that, which is strange. Ah, oh, this is so good. You are stupidly big. You ungrateful, selfish wretch. You come into my house. You lay your filthy man in the camera away. Daughters, and now you even try to steal my property. How dare you? Okay, guys. I'm okay. She's not 100% wrong there. That's all I have to say on that. Worst. Ethan, Ethan, she just threw you three stories. Jesus. And you're still mocking. What a wanker. So this is one thing I'm noticing, though, with the VR on the Resident Evil game. And again, don't forget, this game wasn't initially conceived to be... Well, I, I say conceived. Obviously, Resident Evil 7, from the get-go, was VR compatible. Resident Evil 8 has only just come VR compatible since the PSVR 2 has been released. So um, this game wasn't ever meant, from the get-go, I don't think, to be for the VR2. So it feels like some of the camera angles don't work in the cutscenes as well as they could, because it just doesn't. Yeah, you get blue. In fact, let's check my health. Yeah, I think we should be alright, as long as we don't get caught by her again, because we know what's about to come now. See, this would spoil it for me, because obviously the last one we did with my grip is when I have to press X straight away. If I hadn't played this game before, it's a dead set. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> You, you know, I mean, you just came through the wall. I didn't even. Like I'd let you get away. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Then why don't you just kill me now than oh, doing this? Oh, Honestly, it's like she's not even trying. You... Oh, I can start to feel the, uh, the the nauseous. Oh, I have to grab it now. This time I have to grab it. Come on, run, boys. Why are you not running? She's got up a hand on a leg. Ridiculous. Right. Unless she can cut through that, she can cut through there. That's new. I, well, I, that's new. It's new to me. I never knew she could do that. Yep, yeah, out my way. Ooh. What? Press the wrong button. Oh god, I'm over here. I think I need to play this with a fan. I don't know if it's motion sickness or just heat because obviously I've got this equipment on my head making me overheat and feel just a little hot. <gasps> okay, that's cool. <gasps> It actually, get out of my way. Actually responds. No. To the button I press. That is awesome. And here we go onto one of the easiest boss fights in the game. So you finally came to see me. I did. Everyone falls for me. What the? What the? What the good god shit? There we go. Now. Do you really want to kill me? Yeah, I really, really do. I mean, do I really need to explain this to you? Yeah, that... That was easy. 
Tips for you. Get on the way, help. That I actually think it's hard. It is inconvenient. Ta-da! Nailed it. Legend. So I'm back. Like I said, I had to take a little bit of a pause because I was getting overheated. That's a big thing I find with VR. I think it's just so close in your head. You're a little bit active. And I think it can just lead to uh, a little bit of overheating. It's a very easy thing to do. Uh, let me just check where I'm at. Again, I don't tend to switch using that button on the headset because then it messes up all my audio so I have to mess around with it. So I just wanted to check I'm not too far forward, not too far back. I seem to be okay. So I, <laughs> I also watched my footage back. I didn't realize how rotund I'm starting to look. So that's inspiring the diet to get back on track. I also thought I looked really cool. Um, I don't playing this. Doing stuff like this feels really cool. I feel very fluid, like I'm a badass ninja type character. No, I look like a doofus. Uh, but uh, you know what? I'm still having fun, so I don't care how I look. Uh, I just wish I looked cooler. <laughs> so I don't have to waste ammo. That's so good. This throwing knife is. Awesome. Uh, no, there's nothing in here. I just like to break stuff. There's there's more than oh, 15. No, there's definitely more than 15 bullets in here. I can I can see. Yeah. Anyway, that's uh, fine. Oh, let me just. There we go. Get the headset nice and snuggy wug. Yes, I use the word snuggy wug. Don't judge. Uh, I'm very excited as well because we're very close to unlocking. I say unlocking, uh, accessing a new weapon. <laughs> now, no chance with the with the um, with the knife hitting that target. So squinting. Yes. I honestly, that is for me so far has been the best part of the VR is the fact that I can throw a knife as much as I want. Treasure. Oh, come to daddy. What? Bull. Bull crap. There we go. So I really need to upgrade my inventory space because that was annoying. Is there anything around here? No, there is not. Okay, dokie. Now. Wow. You guys are annoying. And I'm not going to deal with you because I don't actually need to deal with you. I'm just going to run straight past. I'm not going to bother looking for things. Don't care about things. Got my trusty knife. Sure. And you say bolt this game. Oh, okay. That actually makes it worse. Pretending to run makes it worse. Yeah, am, I, am, I, am I going crazy? I'm sure I'm picking up herbs and stuff. And yeah, they don't seem to be getting added to my inventory, which is bizarre. Anyway, let's go see the Duke. In fact, no, let's hold off on the Duke, and I'll tell you for why. Because we got one more. Jesus Christ, that had to scare the crap out of me. Oh, balls, balls, balls. I'm getting confused because I'm trying to turn around to run. Oh, God. This is not good. This is... Duke, Duke, I need, I need some time. Terrible. <sighs> yes, I'm sure you are. You'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Do you have need of anything for the road ahead? Oh, I really do. Yes, I was going to come to you later. I don't think you could expand any more than what you already have. Till next we meet. This is how the uh, doctor told me to apply medicine, just pour it all over your face and hope for the best. Uh, except for the fingers, it seems to be working. I hear this loud ass bitch. Hey. You will learn what it means to insult House Dominatresk. Obviously, you guys can't see, but I'm shaking my booty. Shaking my booty. Because I can shake my booty now because she's physically behind me, so it looks like I can shake my booty in her face. Shake my booty in her face. Uh, I forgot where I'm going. This way. Oh, 
Good strength. <laughs> Jesus Christ. She has some speed on her. I was expecting to come out in full belt. Oh Christ. What's in I want to see what's down there. That looks really intriguing. And yet this cloth is preventing me from progressing. How unfortunate. Okay. So at least we're going to get some mines. I, I, hmm. I don't know how this is going to progress because I've not, I don't think I've thrown a mine yet in this game. So let's, uh, yeah. Yeah. Bear with me. Two ticks. Um, Hang on, am I turned around again? No. Am I? No. It's just this game being weird. There we go. Okay, so. Um. You gonna go, woman? Yeah, I know, I know what. Yeah, this is this is great. Uh, sucks, actually. I'm really grateful I healed first. This way? Okay, that's that. Like that. Harder. What? Shut up. Don't talk dirty to me. How do I? There we go. Oh, you have no idea. Bastard. What did you call me? My body. It's smoking hot. Oh, that extra clip is, uh, is no, really good. so I can look at the back of each mask to see which hole. Oh, nice. Nearly missed. Right, she's going to be right outside here, isn't she? <laughs> Shh. Very, very quiet and be careful. Wow. I've never really looked at the rafters before. The entire oh, shit. No. Nope. How did you know? Because that literally happened seconds ago. Uh, I'm. Can you can you come in this door? Can you come in this door, bitch? <laughs> That's what I thought. Bam, 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 right in the coochie. And I can keep checking. Ooh, I hear that. How dare you try to face me? Duke, 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 I need some help. Help me, Duke. Oh. Yeah, I'm out of here. Oh, oh, oh. She was there a second ago. That was actually quite good. Day. Okay, okay. Is she gonna teleport in again? Right, wait, hold on a second. Let me just make sure I'm still in the right place. Yeah. I have to keep checking because it keeps saying that I'm too close to something when I'm, I'm clearly not. Okay. That's weird. She's like right behind me, but she's not. She pips the wave. But again, she just leave my knife hand free to do that. Oh, wow, that was really cool, close. The damage, not the boobs. Although, yeah, the boobs. I dropped the knife, didn't I? I forgot about that. It looks so freaking awesome. She's such a cool villain. Like your outside matches your inside. 
Just bear with me two ticks, please. Oh god. That. No, let's have a look. How's my health? Red. Yeah, that's um. I picked up a chem fluid. I 100% picked up a chem fluid. I know I did. So what's this game doing? Because I know... Oh, I picked up chem flu, but not first aid. That's what I'm getting confused with, I think. Got yeah. I'm picking up chem flu. I'm not picking up first aid. Okay, guys, I take it back. I'm just being really, really stupid. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Let's rock em, sock em. Ooh, that's close, that's close, that's close, that is close. How am I doing a quick double reload? I really don't. Funny, dear. I think that's funny. Okay. Well, I'm ready for you now. There we go. Damn you. There's literally no way I could survive that. So at this point, my character should be suspecting there's something off with him. Ah, oh, I never noticed it all wiggles. See, I always think of this thing as separate from her, but it should be the same thing, so why is it screaming separately? I don't know, I'm really into it too much. That's freaking cool. Awesome. 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 Oh wow, really good. Can I look at that better? No one is cursed. Yeah, you tell her even. Oh wow, that looks really good. Wings, the booty, the spine. Look at that detail. Oh, I would actually love a statue that looks like that. That was really cool, really like that. Anyway, screw you, but anyway, so we've done it. We've uh, completed House Dantresque. We're now onto House Beneviento, as I like to call it, Danny DeVito. Um, so let me just end this recording. I'll talk to you without this on my head. So guys, there we have it. That was the episode. As I've just mentioned, next one, we're going to be focusing on the House Beneviento, my favorite part of Resident Evil Village. And I cannot wait to play it in VR. Before I load up next time, I'm going to tinker with a few more of the settings. So hopefully the quality might be a little bit better and hopefully I'll not be keep stepping out of the little play area that it's given me because that happened a lot in the second half of this episode. And I'll see you all on the next one. I'm coming very soon. Bye.